Residents in the recaptured Ukrainian city of Leyman await the distribution of humanitarian aid. It was only last week that it was liberated from four months of Russian occupation, and the authorities now have an enormous support task on their hands. You know, almost all the occupied settlements share the same problem, says this spokeswoman for the Donetsk Regional Administration. They're completely destroyed. The infrastructure as well as the houses. And we can see what people need most is psychological support. The flag flies proudly at the entry of the city, but behind it are scenes of devastation. Tetyana is wearing recovered Russian army clothes because her own were destroyed when a rocket hit her house. I was at home when we were struck, she says. I fell into the bathroom and my daughter was in the hallway. How we weren't killed, I don't know. Some Lehman residents express anger towards neighbors who supported the pro-Russian separatist movement before the war. Alexander is proud he held on to his Ukrainian flag. I saved it, he says, because I was waiting for the Ukrainian army to come to liberate us from the Russian yoke. The liberation may have come, but the reconstruction has only just begun.